Your Aunt Bessie is convinced that her vitamin is better than yours, but can her personal experience be called scientific? No, she may be biased towards the vitamin for a number of reasons. Science does objective experiments to minimize bias. If a doctor wants to know if the blue or the red pill is better for lung infection, he asks 100 people with lung infection to take part in an experiment. He randomly chooses 50 to get the blue pill and 50 to get the red one. Random selection ensures both groups will have a random mix of age, gender, race, and so on, and minimizes scientific bias. After five days, 30 people in the red group are better, but 20 still have fever. 45 people in the blue group are better, and only 5 still have fever. In this random sample, the blue pill worked better than the red one. The doctor expects it to also work better for his other patients who are reasonably similar to the people in the experiment. Doctors do randomized controlled trials to test treatments more objectively than your Aunt Bessie.